On the road, he and the group's co-founder, Chauncey Black, were often at odds. There was a little jealousy of the guy who actually made the first hit of the group. When a person have control and they're jealous of something, then they're going to try their best to get the other partner to get that guy out of the group. He started to act different towards Levi and myself. You have a meeting, and then you go to the leader of the group with your problems. But he'll go back and tell Teddy everything we said and everything we was thinking of doing. And, you know, I really felt betrayed by that. They can't get along. They used to fight over the back of the bus. It was just too much going on. Chauncey Black declined to be interviewed for this episode of Unsung. He also declined permission to license before I let you go for this episode. I got too much on my hands and too much on my plate. I'm doing the music. I'm making sure that our records are selling. I don't have time to keep kids together. So in the end, Dave decided to leave Blackstreet. I was starting to get offers to do duets with people. I told him I wanted to be released. Took him a couple of months, but you know, he let me go.